Hello everyone, Assalamu Alaikum. Uh, we are going to discuss about the four possible Slutsky equations. So in the last lecture of the Slutsky equation, we tried in detail what is the graphical mechanism will be used to drive the Slutsky equation, number one. Then we will discuss a lot on the equation. Basically, the total effect is equal to the substitution effect minus income effect. And we discuss in a different approach how this equation is verified and balanced and the uh, different approach we have been used there then later on we discuss that if this is the term that we can say that the total impact of the consumption x by the change in the price x is equal to the substitution effect minus income effect so the basic slash equation we derived that the change in x total effect is equal to the change in x substitution effect minus the change in x due to the income effect so we discussed only the one case the change in price of x now we have to discuss the different cases and we discuss that k by using the same approach <coughs> we can drive the four possible slutsky equations and uh, uh, four possible Slutsky equation means that because we are discussing the two commodity case number one so each commodity has their own price and the each commodity can be discussed with the effect of the cross price so if there are the two commodities so the, there will be the two equation we will have to drive with the own price impact and then the same two equations will be derived from the cross price effect so let's we discuss that so what are these basically the number one the change in x change in x change in x it's total substitution and impact effect first we drive the own price impact this commodity x and the impact of the price x so what will be uh, this is total effect this is substitution effect this is income effect and then we uh, understand that term introduce delta m over delta m and uh, if we will rearrange and convert the whole equation into the partial derivative so it will be the partial derivative change in x with respect to the change in price total impact change in x with respect to total change in, uh, change in price of x substitution effect and this is a numerator now we will make the den denominator change in m so the partial derivative the change in x with respect to the change in income and this delta m and this delta px will be together in the numerator and denominator and we know that we discuss in the derivation that the change in m change in px is basically equal to x and we uh, discuss in last lecture of the slutsky equation in detail how it is it it, it, uh, it is derived from the uh, approach of the total derivative by using the uh, budget constraint and simple we can say that this is a shepherd lemma ki change in expenditure function with respect to change in price of x so we get the demand function mil jata hai. or at optimization the Hitchin demand function and marginal demand function a, a same so we can write the first slots ki equation jo likh sakte and we can write that change in x change in price of x is equal to change in x change in price of x minus change in x change in income and x marginal linear function ab main aapko isme ek aur cheez batata hu ki isme humne t aur s jo hai wo mukhtalif books mein is tarah likha milta hai ki this is the total effect so we will make this line and we will use the t this is the total effect this is the substitution effect and this is basically the income effect and this is the marginal linear demand function this is the first equation of first so Slutsky equation with the own price impact of the commodity x now we have to discuss the second Slutsky equation with the cross price effect same approach use karenge change in x change in substitute total effect substitution effect income effect but the difference is that now we are going to analyze the change in x with respect to change in p y so just say we have seen it here I will evaluate it here that you will have ये कमोडिटी एक्स है कमोडिटी वाई सो वी डिस्कस दैट कि हमें एक इंडिफरेंस कर्व मिल जाता है और ये हमारा टेंजेंट बन जाता है 
नाउ वी आर सेइंग दैट सेंगे चेंज इन प्राइस ऑफ एक्स में कोई इजाफा नहीं हो रहा या चेंज नहीं आ रहा नाउ वी आर डिस्कसिंग द चेंज इन पी वाई सो पी वाई अगर इंक्रीज करती है तो बजट लाइन इस तरह से श्रिंक होगी फ्रॉम दैट साइड देन एज एज दिस डिस्कशन की जो कंजम्पन ऑफ वाई है वो पहले इधर थी वाई वन अब वो और नीचे जाएगी और वो यहाँ पर कहीं यू टू बनाएगा और दिस इज बेसिकली दाई टू सो हम क्रॉस प्राइस भी टोटल इम्पैक्ट और सब्सटीट्यूशन इफेक्ट और इनकम इफेक्ट ऑब्जर्व कर सकते हैं सो दिस इज दिस की क्वेश्चन द क्रॉस प्राइस एंड इन द क्रॉस प्राइस सिंपल वी विल कन्वर्ट दीज चेंज साइन इन टू द पार्शल डेरेवेटिव एंड वेल वी कन्वर्ट इट सो सिमिलरली दिस डेल्टा एम और डेल्टा एम विल बी will be rearranged and this denominator part will go in the uh, term of the third term and again we can write in this form the change in x change in p p y and change in x with respect to change in p y and change in x with respect to change in income and this is a total in fact this is a substitution effect and this is the income effect now we used here x marginal demand function but now we have to use the y marginal demand function in th this is a difference we will have to observe in the cross price elasticity uh, cross cross price slutsky equation why it is happening again i will tell you this is a shepherd lemma shepherd lemma says that if we are taking the derivative of the uh, expenditure function with respect to the px so the result will be the uh, demand function of the commodity x and if simple we are taking the derivative with respect to py so we will take the demand function of uh, y so आसान है याद रखने के लिए कि जिसकी प्राइस की रिस्पेक्ट से आप चेंज ओवर एम और चेंज ऑफ पी एक्स करेंगे वही डिमांड फंक्शन आपको मिलेगा यहाँ पी वाई से कर रहे हैं तो यहाँ पर आपको वाई का डिमांड फंक्शन मिलेगा तो दीज आर टू सेकेंड इक्वेशन ऑफ द स्लैट्स की नाव वी हैव टू ड्राइव टू मोर सो दिस इज द ओन प्राइस विद रिस्पेक्ट टू कमोडिटी एक्स दिस इज अगेन द ओन प्राइस नाव वी आर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द कमोडिटी वाई and the commodity y with respect to the py means that the change in total impact substitution effect income effect and then we introduce the term of that delta m over delta m rearranged and converting the change sign into the partial derivative so finally we may write the equation the change in y with respect to the own price is equal to change in y with respect to the own price change in y with respect to the income and again i told you ki jiski respect hogi price ki wohi hame demand function mil jayega and this is the total impact this is the substitution effect and this is, is basically the income effect so this is the third slutsky equation we achieved and by using the same approach we have to discuss the cross price impact of the commodity y and if we will discuss the cross price impact so we will make the total substitution and income effect introduce the term of the delta m over delta m and then the rearrange and apply the partial derivative so we achieve the same thing and in this last step we can also write in this way the change in y with respect to the change in p y px the cross price is equal to change in y with respect to the change in px again the cross price and change in y change in the income and this term will give the marginal demand function of x because with respect to price we are taking the derivative so it will the x to ye dekhiye yahan price of x thi to x mila yahan price of y thi to y mila yahan price of y thi to y mila aur yahan pe price of x hai to hame x milega aur this is the basically total impact this is substitution impact and this is the income effect so four possible slutsky equation we can derive easily by using the, the, these equations and the concept behind this the graphical uh, presentation we have discussed in the lecture of the slutsky equation so i hope that the all four uh, slutsky equations can be drawn by by uh, by learning from this lecture and please subscribe our channel for more videos thank you very much